हेलो वेलकम अगेन वी आर सॉल्विंग गेट मैकेनिकल ईयर 2021 पेपर 1 ओके क्वेश्चन नंबर 52 इज द विदवर्थ क्यूपिटन मैकेनिज्म इज शोन इन द फिगर विद लिंक लेंथ एज फॉलोस ओपी इज 300 एमएम ओए इज 150 एमएम एआर इज 160 एमएम एंड आर इज 1 एज इज 450 एमएम ओके सो दिस इज योर ओपी 150 एमएम for the oa 150 mm and uh, op 300 mm and oa and uh, sorry ar 160 mm and rs has 450 mm okay the quick return ratio for the mechanism is dash round of to one decimal place okay so this is your fixed link because in the virtual mechanism the shortest link is your fixed link okay and this is the normal configuration given this is this is op this is again uh, this is your uh, or okay and this is your rs okay so when uh, the when this crank this is this behaves as a crank okay when this crank reaches here p dash then this point will be opposite to this and the slider will be at extreme backward position okay so this is this represents the extreme backward position of the uh, crank of the slider okay and when the this speed point is at p double dash then the this point will be in this direction and the slider will be on extreme forward position okay so if the if this o p is rotating in uniform with the uniform speed okay then this will be the angle travel from extreme backward position to extreme forward position okay or the angle travel during forward stroke okay and this will be the angle travel during reverse stroke okay now from the configuration we have o a p dash okay and this angle is your alpha so this angle will, will be your alpha by 2 so cos alpha by 2 will be equal to uh, o a yeah, or a o divided by o p dash okay a o by o p and o p dash is equal to o p so a o and o p are given that is 150 and 300 so this is your 1 by 2 so alpha by 2 is your 60 degree so alpha is your 120 degree okay so alpha is your 120 degree and uh, this is your 360 minus 120 that is uh, 240 okay. so 240 by 120 is your uh, critical return ratio that is 2 is your critical return ratio this angle divided by this angle so this is uh, rotating at, uh, at uniform speed so and the angle during the forward stroke is this and during the reverse stroke is this okay, so they will uh, take uh, the time according to this angle okay, so answer is your 2 next a short shoe drum radius 260 mm break is shown in the figure a fourth of 1 kN is applied to the lever the coefficient of friction is 0.4 okay so this is your drum as we rotating in clockwise direction this is 500 this is 500 one kilo ton. this is 310 this is radius is 260 okay the magnitude of torque applied by the brake is dash newton meter round up to one decimal place okay so uh, let us assume that r and b the reaction okay as drum is rotating in a clockwise direction so the brake can be zoomed to rotate in an anti-clockwise direction relative to drum okay, so the force of friction acting on the brake is mu rn this is the normal direction on brake okay this is 310 this is 500 this is 500 this is 1 kilonewton this is radius is 260 okay so taking moment about the fulcrum this point okay that is 1 into 1000 minus rn into 500 minus uh, point four into this distance. So this dis this distance is this distance is three hundred ten. This is sixty. So this will be fifty. Okay. So this is your fifty. So from this we can find out R n. So R n comes out as mu is given as mu is point four. Okay. So R n comes out as uh, one point nine two kilonewton. So from Rn we can create uh, the breaking torque that is given by mu Rn to radius of drum. 
so 5.4 into 1.92 into 1000 261000 or this is 200 newton meter so answer is 200 newton meter